Dr. Jen is here with your daily dose I of answers you, to I your I love mouth. when you say that. <laughs> I'll try to sprinkle it in a few more times. Thank you. Um, <laughs> Just for TJ. Will you get All it together, right. Rose? <laughs> First question. Uh, is the flu season going to be worse because last year's was so mild? This is the question that a lot of infectious disease specialists and public health officials are asking. And the short answer is the only thing predictable about a flu season is that it is unpredictable. Mm -hmm. uh, but we tend to look at the southern hemisphere for clues because they're ahead of us uh, weather-wise and it's certainly in terms of the flu season. And right now, kind of conflicting. Australia, which most people... <laughs> <laughs> I, wow, the I swear came back I just right. did it. When you said Southern Hemisphere, I got a twinkle there in my eye. There you go. Okay, well, sorry, continue. In, in Australia, they've obviously been very aggressive mm. with their COVID lockdown restrictions, so they haven't seen very much influenza. But China has seen a moderate flu season, so mm. people are concerned here that we may be seeing that twindemic. Uh, so, again, you're going to start hearing us talk about it all the time flu vaccines recommended by the CDC by the end of October. and. They're already out and available so people can get them starting now. All right, another question here. Is frozen fruit healthier than fresh fruit that we get from markets in place like Melbourne? <laughs> See, see what he's doing there? I, saw, I, I heard. Uh, this is a great question. And so from the nutritional science data, it, it is definitely as healthy. And there are some studies and some indications that it could be even healthier for several reasons. Number one, it is always picked. We're talking about frozen fruit, fruit now. At its ripest yeah. point. So it is locked in. Those nutrients and antioxidants are really locked in. They don't tend to deteriorate as they sit out on the counter or in the fridge. Um, it can be cheaper, which is nice. They're really great to put in smoothies and shakes and all kinds of things like that so um, it is definitely not unhealthy and some people believe it can be healthier mm. than fresh fruit at the end of the day just eat a lot of color so yeah. any way you can get it get it all right sounds good thank you very much you dr bet. jen and you can submit questions to dr jen on her instagram at dr j ashton well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.